Hi, so I'm Mrs Wrigley and I'm the lead teacher for biology um, at Kirby Kendall and I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about why A-level biology is such a wonderful um, A-level choice. It's a fantastic, challenging A-level. It will take you out of your comfort zone, which is a really good thing. It will enrich you and it will open your eyes to loads of really cool things in the biological world. Okay, so with A-level biology, um, ideally we'd like a grade six um, at GCSE um, in either combined or separate sciences. Um, you're not hindered either way. Um, with, with either GCSE, we accept students with a good grade six in biology on either, and we preferably like um, a six in maths also. Um, the content of maths at biology A level is 10%, but the level of um, you know, requirement and prior knowledge is up to grade six at GCSE. Um, in terms of what we cover, we cover so many really exciting, interesting topics. So we cover cell biology, we look at microscopy, we look at biological molecules, um, proteins, carbohydrates, lipids. We look at the intricacies of different microscopes. We look at electron and we look at light microscopes. We look at um, respiration, photosynthesis. We look at the nervous system, genetics, homeostasis. The list goes on massively. A really, really topical area that we look at is the immune system, which is obviously very exciting and dynamic at the moment, and particularly with the current global pandemic. And it gives us a greater understanding of how vaccines are formed, and how our immune system responds, and all the intricacies of the cells and separate systems there. We also cover a range of practicals in A-level biology, and that's a similar setup to GCSE. So we do required practicals um, and the practicals you could be asked on in your exam. The beauty of doing a scientific A-level, particularly biology, is that it shows you to be a logical thinker, it shows you to be practical skilled, and it shows that you're willing to think outside the box. It really develops your application skills, we really focus on that at A-level, and it asks you to apply what you already know to a new situation, um, and for example, applying what you might already know about enzyme substrate complexes to the development and implication of a new drug. In terms of careers, there's a whole range of, of different careers that you could pursue from A-level biology. Um, without sounding cheesy, the world really is your oyster if you pursue such, a, such an A-level. Um, we've got two ex-biology students who are currently working on the COVID vaccine, two different teams, which is really exciting and they keep me updated with their developments. Um, and we've also got a really cool job held by an ex-biologist at Kirby Kendall, who is a wildlife photographer and has done lots of work with David Attenborough filming part of the, um, the Arctic footage for him. I've got another student who's a parasitologist who spends part of her year in Brazil looking at parasites in the rainforest and she's currently based at Liverpool School of, um, of Tropical Medicine which is awesome. Lots of our students go on to do science degrees, um, physiology, um, physiotherapy, biomedical science, medicine to name but a few. But the key thing as I said with a a biology um, A level is it shows you to be a clear, logical, methodical thinker, and that's such a good transferable skill, um, you know, in today's climate. So thanks very much for listening. Um, really important for me to say, if you're an external candidate, um, then please do get in touch with the science department. Get in touch, and we'll happily answer any further questions. And if you're a current Year 11 student, please get in touch with us directly. Also, I would be happy to discuss further what a wonderful A level um, biology is. Thank you.